so you can reference this in the book of Genesis, chapter 16 and verse 13, where we have Hagar, who was a slave of Abraham and Sarah, and she was casted out into the wilderness. But while she was out there, the Lord came and spoke to her, and she, in return, gave him his name, the God of Seeing. So today, ladies, I want you to know that if you ever feel unseen, know that your Papa God sees everything. The first thing that I want you to know that God sees you acceptable. So in scripture, in Titus chapter 3, verse 7, it says that Jesus thought that you were worthy enough, even if you didn't feel like you deserved it, for him to go to the cross for you and take your sins for you. He felt that you were worthy of that. Amen? So Jesus made it acceptable to God. He made you acceptable to him by the way of him just going to the cross, when he was nailed to that cross, he was able to give us hope for an eternal life. Amen? Amen. 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 So, the second thing that I want you to know is that God sees you as valuable. Amen? Amen. 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 So, in scripture, 1 Corinthians chapter 6, verse 20, it says that you are God's expensive purchase. Whoa. That means that Jesus paid a high price for you and I yes. with the tears of his blood. Amen. Amen. So therefore, we are to glorify him by the ways of our walk, by our bodies, our minds, our spirits, and our souls. So the third thing that I want you to know is that God sees you as capable. So in scripture, in 2 Corinthians chapter 3, verses 5 through 6, it tells us that the capacity that you and I have been given is given to you by God alone. So we are all capable because we have God's word, which is truth, it's insight, as well as wisdom for each one of our lives. So when we are weak, he is strong. Yes. And we know that in Philippians 4.13, that he has gave himself yeah. to make us capable. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Through his blood, we can do all things. Yeah. Yeah. So with that being said, that's exactly how God sees you. And I want everybody to take this moment to repeat after me as we declare and we speak the truth of God's word over ourselves today. So if you don't mind, I am, I am, I am acceptable, I am acceptable, I am valuable, I am valuable, and I am capable, and I am capable. So, I want to leave you with this thing here, is that the God of seeing is not blind to your good works, and he is not blind to the light, he is not blind to the things you need. Yes. Yes. And he sees all of you, every bit of you, and he loves every single thing about you. Amen. So when you leave here today, I want you to know that if you ever feel unseen, that the Lord your God not only sees all of you, that he will never lose sight of you as you go about your day. Yes. Know that you are worth dying for. Wow. Know that you are less than highly favored. Yes, Lord. Know that you are loved and know that you are seen. Yes. Yes.